Hello everyone, and welcome back to my channel. In today's video, we'll talk about a method that will save you a lot of frustration when using Windows 11, excluding specific files or folders from Windows Security, also known as Windows Defender. Windows Defender is the built-in antivirus program for Windows 10 and Windows 11. Windows Defender runs silently in the background, providing real-time protection and constantly monitoring for potential harm. While it's effective at keeping out threats, it can sometimes be overprotective. During a scan, Windows Defender scans each folder and flags it if necessary. This is a good thing, and you don't have to worry about a forgotten folder containing unwanted software or viruses. However, Windows Defender may identify regular folders or files as viruses. Sometimes it classifies certain tools as viruses, a process called a false positive. To avoid these false positives, you can exclude a file or folder so that Windows Defender won't scan it in the future. This is what we will learn step by step. To open Windows Security, click on the Start menu. Type Windows Security in the search bar and click on it to open it. This application is sometimes called Windows Defender Security Center in older versions of Windows 10. After opening the application, click the Virus and Threat Protection section. This section contains all the real-time protection settings, scan history, and advanced security options. Then scroll down and under Virus and Threat Protection Settings and click Manage Settings. This section allows you to control features like real-time protection, cloud protection, and exclusions. Then scroll down to the Exclusions section and click Add or Remove Exclusions. This feature tells Windows Security not to scan these files, folders, and file types, or processes. All you have to do now is click on Add a new exclusion, and a drop-down menu will appear with four options, File, Folder, File Type, and Process. Most people use the Folder option when dealing with software tools or project folders. So, if you want to add a folder, click on Folder. A browse window will appear, allowing you to navigate to the folder you want to exclude and select it to add it to the exclusions list. As I mentioned, the drop-down menu has four options. File, if you want to exclude a specific file. Folder, if you want to exclude an entire folder and its contents from Windows Defender scanning. And file type, if you want to exclude all files with a specific extension, such as .exe. And finally, process, which is used to exclude a running process from scanning. From now, Windows Defender will not scan or remove items from this location. And you should only exclude files and folders that you are absolutely sure are safe. Adding exceptions for unknown or suspicious files may expose your computer to real threats. You can also remove or delete any folder from this list by clicking on it and selecting the Remove option. Once removed, Windows Defender will scan this folder as long as it is not in the exclusions list. That's all in today's video. We've learned step by step how to exclude files, folders, file types, or processes in Windows Security on Windows 11. This is a powerful feature for avoiding false positives and keeping your workflow running smoothly, especially if you're working with specific tools or scripts that Windows Defender often flags. But remember, only exclude items you absolutely trust. If you found this video helpful, please like it, subscribe to my channel for more tech tips, and turn on the notification bell so you don't miss future videos. Thanks for watching and see you in the next video.